Hi, I'm Brandon Sweeney from Ascentium, and today we're introducing our new line of anti-static materials. Ascentium has teamed up with Crota, a world-leading supplier of polymer additives, to commercialize their ion phase permanent anti-static additives for 3D printing. Anti-static additives lower the resistivity of plastics and prevent static issues including electrostatic attraction and electrostatic discharge. Anti-static materials are a subset of ESD-safe materials, which are designed to limit the buildup of static charge and mitigate the risk of causing a static discharge event by dissipating those charges at a safe rate when electrically connected to ground. Their primary use is protecting sensitive electronics during manufacturing or servicing and preventing arcs that could ignite flammable materials. Anti-static materials are different than other ESD-safe materials because they use inherently dissipated polymers, or IDPs, rather than carbon or metallic-based fillers to provide the required electrical properties. This has several benefits. The most obvious is that we can produce these anti-stat materials in a variety of colors. This is critical for industries that need ESD-safe materials, but require a specific color for safety or identification requirements. An example of this is no-fly parts in the space vehicle and satellite industry where caps, covers, and protectors must be bright red to indicate they need to be removed prior to launch. Compared with carbon-based additives, our anti-static line of filaments have very uniform electrical properties that are insensitive to print orientation and process parameters. Another unique benefit of anti-static materials is their cleanliness. The anti-static additive is a polymer, so there's zero chance of conductive carbon particles contaminating clean surfaces. A major difference between anti-static additives and carbon-based additives is the loading level needed to achieve the required electrical properties. For our Z-line of materials, we typically need less than 5% of carbon nanotubes in the coating, whereas anti-static additives are typically loaded between 10 and 20% to achieve sufficient resistivity. This can lead to a slight change in mechanical properties of the base polymer, so be sure to check the TDS to ensure the material will work for your application. The electrical properties of anti-static materials are characterized by performing surface and volume resistance measurements. Ascentium's anti-stat materials will have both surface and volume resistance values between 1 e to the 8th and 1 e to the 10th ohms. Charge decay testing is another electrical test method which determines how quickly an induced charge is dissipated once the object is connected to ground. There are several standards that govern this, but general decay rates are less than two seconds. Our anti-stat materials have been tested and shown to pass this requirement. The first material we're launching in our anti-stat line is a 58D shore hardness TPU. This material is great for custom dust caps and covers and any other part designed to protect high value assets during the manufacturing process. We recommend that you keep the material dry while printing for the best surface finish and mechanical properties. And if you'd like to learn more about our anti-stat filaments and other materials, head to our website at ascentium.com materials.